Hey everyone, it's Whitney, and today I am doing a blue look. Um, I know that spring and summer are coming really, really soon, and these colors remind me of spring and summer. It's a kind of aqua light blue paired with a darker deep blue, and I think it's gorgeous. I think it's so pretty, and it reminds me of spring and summer, so um, I'm really looking forward to that. So I was just kind of playing with these colors today and came up with this. And I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Uh, let me know what you guys think in the comment section. And let's go ahead and get started. First, I'm going to go ahead and prime my eyes. And I'm using the Urban Decay Primer Potion. And it's in this cute little bottle like this. So I'm going to go ahead and prime my eyes. And do it all the way up to the brow bone, just like that. And blend that out. So all the eyeshadows that I'm using today are actually coming from this Sephora... Um, box thing that I got this past Christmas. I found it at JCPenney. It was kind of um, just a seasonal thing, I think. I don't think you can get this anymore, but if you have any, you know, drugstore brand colors similar to these, uh, your look should be just fine. It doesn't have to be Sephora. So uh, whatever you have, you can definitely uh, recreate this look. So let's go ahead and get started. Today I'm going to be using a base and it's kind of a aqua till blue kind of color and it looks like this. It's this one right there. Just a really, really gorgeous color. And I'm going to go ahead and stick some of this on my lid. I'm just using my ring finger right now and I'm just going to get this all across my lid and into the crease a little bit. Just kind of blend it in. And I'm kind of fading it um, as I go up into the crease a little bit, so it's kind of a gradient. Um, just kind of fading it out as I get even further above the crease, so like that. Alright, once I've done that, I'm going to go ahead and do my highlight color. And it is a white all the way at the bottom here, so I'm going to grab that color just with my MAC flat shader brush. It's the 239, but whatever, um, you know, eyeshadow brush you use will work just fine. So I'm going to get some of that and tap it off and stick this right underneath my brow bone here. Next, with the same brush, I'm going to grab this color right here, and it's just kind of a aqua blue, and it's just really, really pretty. So I'm going to grab that on the same brush, pick some of that up, and I'm just going to start packing this on the inner part of my eye, the inner corner. I'm just kind of packing that on there. And with this base, this is so pretty. It just makes the color stand out even more. So I really like this on this base. So I'm just kind of working that into um, the base that we have applied and just kind of working that into that. And bringing it all the way out to the corner of my eye. I'm just going to grab a little more and stick it on the outer part of my eye. Just mainly concentrating on the uh, lid right now. The next color I'm going to take is this one right here. It's just kind of a deeper blue up top here. And I'm going to take this on just a pencil brush like this and get some of that. I'm going to go ahead and stick this up above my crease, about right here. Just kind of line that in. And it doesn't matter if it's sloppy right now because we have to blend all this out, but just kind of lining that above the crease. Now I'm just going to take my blending brush here and start blending this out. I'm just doing circular motions right now. Now I'm going to wipe off my blending brush really well and I'm going to grab this right here which is kind of a skin tone color and it's matte. So I'm going to grab this with the uh, clean blending brush. Grab some of that and I'm just going to put it right above the color we just applied. I'm going to wipe off my pencil brush really well and I'm going to grab this right here. It's a very deep blue. It's 
the one that I used uh, right here, but I'm using the one just right beside it. This is really, really dark blue, and I'm just going to take that on the pencil brush, get just a little bit, knock off the excess, and then I'm going to stick this right here into the outer V, right there. And I'm going to bring it down along the uh, outer part of my lash line, like this. And I'm bringing it up into the crease just a little bit. I'm going to drag just a little bit down along my lower lash line. Next I'm going to take my blending brush and go ahead and start blending this out. Concentrating mostly on the outer part where we just applied that darker blue. So just mainly keeping it on the outer part of my eye. Just kind of blending that all together along the lash line even. Make sure you don't poke yourself in the eye. <laughs> I'm going to be using the Urban Decay 24-7 uh, liner in Zero, and it's just a pencil liner. So I'm going to go ahead and stick some on my waterline and on my lower waterline here. I'm also going to gently pull my eye and stick some on my top line here, just to about halfway on my lid, take my pencil brush and just run that across there. Today for mascara I'm going to be using the Maybelline Pulse Perfection Mascara and I love this stuff so much and it looks like this. Today for blush I'm using Max Well Dressed and it looks like this. Just a really really pretty bright pink with kind of a purple hint to it. I'm going to be first applying my MAC Tinder Tone in Hush Hush. Then I'm going to go ahead and apply my MAC lipstick in Hue, and it looks like this. This right here, it's Beauty Rush by Victoria's Secret. And this one is in Strawberry Fizz. Great, so this is my completed look. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you're doing well, and I will talk to you guys very soon.